around and they have a lot of snow here at the beast. season we are 100% open with 140 trails, 71 miles of skiable trails and 751 acres of skiable trails. It's been awesome. We got the four um, terrain parks open. The stash is a Burns all natural terrain park with all natural features found in the Vermont woods and we have a 22 foot super pipe, Olympic sized pipe over at Bear Mountain as well as a mini pipe at Timberline for all those mini little shredders. Weekend trips are the best at Killington. We have a ton of condos to stay in that are skiing, ski out trails. And we also have the Grand Hotel. It's a ski bridge right across from the slopes. Great location, great places to stay. Tons of restaurants. Wobbly Barn is a famous steakhouse here at Killington. Party all night there at the nightclub. We also have the all new Ledgewood Yurt. Uh, you get to go on a sleigh pulled by a snowcat on the ski trails and enjoy a five course fine dining experience in the heart of the Green Mountains. It's absolutely incredible. Uh, to be honest with you, I every day at Killington this season has been outstanding. I've just been having so much fun. Everything from like the powder days to the long cruisers, it's been incredible. I can't get enough of it. It's completely addicting and I have I couldn't think of a better place to be for the winter. for seven, um, can't get enough of it. It's, it's a great place and the terrain parks are awesome. You can have, you have terrain from beginning to experience level, double black diamonds, getting in the pow, nice blower snow like out west. It can't ask for anything better. Love it here, would never go any place else. The beast of the east is where it's at. so much snow in Vermont this year, the local Killington area businesses are loving it. We have the Aspen East Ski Shop down at the bottom of the uh, Killington Road at the Tonight Temperature sign on Route 4. Uh, it was voted the top ski shop in New England by Ski Magazine twice and uh, it's probably one of the best ski and ski boot selling years that we've seen in years. This is probably one of the greatest seasons I've seen since uh, the winter of 70-71 in Arden. 
The snow is unbelievable. You can ski anywhere on this mountain in the last, say, five or six weeks. There's been no meltdown, so the snow has stayed. It, all the tree skiing is at its best. The trails are groomed. There's plenty of skiing for every level of ability here. And anybody who wants to enjoy winter sports, you come up right now and enjoy Killington, Vermont. I'm up at Killington here in the East Coast at one of the biggest mountains. So I guess that's why they call it the Beast, because it really is. And I wanted to uh, actually try out some new skis. A friend of mine uh, recommended uh, a ski in the line that I like to ski on, which is K2, and it's actually the K2 Richter. I picked up the ski, the Richter K2, at Aspen East. Uh, actually, wonderful shop to uh, deal with because they had um, everything that you can think of. It, it just takes you back in time. They have a gondola hanging there in the foyer from you know, 1969, I think he told me, and it's just it's so tripped out. But you know, while you're there, you're definitely going to find something that you need and uh, add to your, your wardrobe for a ski season. If not this year, definitely for next year. Um, although the winter has been incredible, my favorite time of the season is the spring skiing here at Killington. We get softer snow, tons of sunshine, warmer temperatures, and with the, all the snowfall this year, we have an incredible base, so we're going to be skiing and snowboarding well into April. Killington is a big mountain. It's a quick drive from Wilkes-Barre, Scranton, and Poconos area. We're open seven days a week, 9 to 4 p.m. on Monday through Friday, and Saturday and Sunday we start spinning lifts at 8 a.m. in the morning till 4 p.m. For more information to check out the conditions, trails, and list report, visit Killington.com.